Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I'm the host and the visionary of the Valder Beebe Show, God Talk. Some people talk to God and others believe that God talks to them. Join us in conversation with authors, religious clergy, metaphysicians, and regular people like you and I and God Talk. God Talk is a podcast available on FM Radio, Roku TV, and online. Subscribe at ValderBBShow.com. You can also subscribe at YouTube.com slash ValderBBShow. Join the conversation of God Talk. I'll see you there. Good day, Shan Boudram. Thanks for being live on the Valder BB Show. How are you today? I'm doing amazing, Valder. I was just told how incredible you are. So you have well, already thanks. made a great first impression. Well, I was told how smart and beautiful you are, and you are here on the Valder BB Show, so you have made my day. We are just showing people how to do a first date right now. We're knocking it out of the park. All right. So, okay, tr- dates must be hard. I've been married a long time, Sham. We ain't going to talk about how long. I'll just tell you since the beginning <laughs> of time. And I'm happy. But my children, I see them dating. Tell me some things that I can say to them because travel this year is expected to be at an all-time summer high. So what, do, what tips do you have when someone's looking to find a date while traveling over the next six months? Yeah, well, you definitely want to start by asking your kids some questions. What do you want? Do you want to meet friends? Do you want to meet a potential long-term partner? Do you want to just meet someone who could take you to a great restaurant somewhere? These are important questions to ask yourself because this sets the intention for the action you're going to put behind it. And one of the easy ways that Bumble is making it to put action behind the intention when it comes to dating and traveling is through the travel mode. Travel mode allows you to actually change your location for swiping either before or while you are in a location. That way you've got some time to see what's out there for you and to try to make some connections beforehand. Same way that you would plan ahead when it comes to choosing how you're going to spend your days, find some um, choices for date nights. I want my audience to know that Shan Boudram, she's a certified sex educator and an intimacy expert. You're getting great information. You guys take notes. Okay, Shan, do you have any tips for our audience in optimizing those dating profiles? Yes. And I think, again, you know, if you've got a great mom like you who's willing to help out, enlist the help of that person. When it comes to dating profiles, it's about putting the best version of you face forward and also in the multidimensional way that you exist. So have a friend or someone trusted go through your profile and be like, Hey, why didn't you mention this? Or why didn't you use the badge features? So Bumble has a badge feature where you can put what really matters to you right front and center. So there's no guessing game when it comes to what somebody is about. Um, I think that dating apps are doing a really incredible job of showing a snapshot of the whole person in a very short amount of time. So use the features, update them often, and make sure that you get a friend or two in there to make, to give you the okay, that this is actually the true best you. Okay. My kids are more savvy than I, when they do these dating, but I always worry when they make that first date, when they meet that person in, in, in person, you have any, um, ideas on that so I can calm myself down. Yes. I mean, it would definitely probably help if your kid said, look, I've already had a video call with them. We didn't exchange personal information. We did it all through the Bumble app. I have already gone through their profile extensively. They're actually verified on Bumble. So they are who they say that they are. And I chose the location to ensure it's somewhere that I feel safe and comfortable in and that I know how to leave or go somewhere exciting afterwards because I'm in control. So if your kid did that little bit of extra work, you probably would feel a lot more at ease and Furthermore, they would feel at ease most importantly, because when it comes to dates, yes, we want to meet somebody amazing, but more importantly, we want to put ourselves in a position to be the most amazing version of ourselves because the world's a giant mirror. If I feel relaxed and comfortable, likely my date will feel the exact same way. And then I will have a better time. And that's the whole point. Okay. So after we've watched the dating swindler on like lifetime TV, What's different about Bumble? What gives us security that, you know, going on Bumble will be a better experience? 
Well, first and foremost, Bumble is a woman's first dating app. So women are in control in terms of starting the conversation. So you've got a little bit more time once you match with someone to actually go through their profile and see like, does anything feel fishy to me? Now, one of the things that could feel fishy is that people on Bumble should verify themselves and their identity, which eliminates catfishing. So they've got a system in place that says, Hey, are you actually who you say that you are? If someone's not verified, that can be in your early messaging conversations of like, Hey, would you mind verifying yourself, especially before we make any in-person plans? And then in addition to that, using the features in app, because giving yourself a chance to make a decision before you make an investment is really important. So researching again about the person on their profile, but then furthermore, set up a virtual date before you actually meet in person. And you can ask some really important questions on that virtual date to see if it's even worth your time or safe for your time from there. And how do you get started on Bumble as I wrap up? Oh, easiest thing possible. You can download it at your app store. It is free. You can use Bumble BFF to meet friends or Bumble Biz to meet business partners. It's a connecting app more than it is a dating app. But I mean, that should be um, hopefully a no brainer for everyone. Well, Shan, you lived up to everything my producers told me. They told me you were smart, you were beautiful, you were savvy, and you were very informative on the Belder BB show. Thank you so very much. Well, thank you so much. Pass on my number to your producers. They sound lovely. I mean, for <laughs> friendship purposes, I'm, I'm in the friendship business. <laughs> Hi, I'm Valder BB. I host the Valder BB show broadcast on radio and television. And this is my phone pouch. My phone pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands free, pocket free, purse free, even belt free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com.